Oh, man, I swear, I feel like I just cannot hit on this app ever. Oh, what's up with you YouTube? Jumping Chris here. We're coming back at y'all with another vid. And today, well, we're here in Canton, Ohio, which is like a little bit outside of Cleveland, I believe. I got an event going on tomorrow. That's why I'm here. Uh, it's at the Rock or Stock or Stock Shoe event in Canton, Ohio. So if you guys are in there, make sure you guys pull up. By the time you guys watch this video, it'll be happening today, I'm guessing, because it's on September 24th. Anyways, I was trying to get the W for some yellow toes, and you know what? I'm trying to like get, at least do a double up. I did already get a, a W on the shock drop, but you know what? Move that that size. So I was like thinking, I was like, oh, I just think these are gonna be pretty easy, man. No one likes Air Jordan ones no more. To my surprise, I probably can't even get a W. We gotta do what we gotta do, right? Call up the homie up. He's in Canton, Ohio. He has his own store, and he's like, "Yo, I got you." And I was like, "Oh, for real?" And so we're gonna come through, come through the store. Do a little pickup vlog and all that stuff. Need to make some content, do a pickup vlog for the yellow toes, see how difficult it was to get it. And it seemed it was actually wasn't as easy as I, I thought it was gonna be. But hey, maybe some people, some uh, cities have, you guys have more stores or whatever, but it's all good. So hopefully we're able to get a W. They're not going for much, so I do plan on buying them eventually. Just waiting to see what the price gonna look like later on the road. But still, it's a very nice looking shoe. I gotta have at least a personal. I gotta have a personal. So that's what we're here for. We're gonna pick these things up, man. Check them out. And we're gonna check out the store too as well. So. We're here at my boy's uh, shop, man. It's your new shop. It's your actual shop here, and we met through a couple, you know, events in Ohio. Just some retros, which majority of you know, like small shop here. You know, do some consignments, obviously, too, as well. And I see yellow toes, so that's that's a good sign, guys. Yes, sir. So we got yellow toes. But he, what he mainly do is you. Also, what he mainly does here is he does a lot of um, restorations of your shop, right? Well. Um we are a consignment uh, restoration shop. Uh, okay. Restoration is the main thing that we do here. Um, we do everything from deep cleans to icing um, to uh, customs. I see uh, your icing machines. Is this yes. what these are? This one? Yes. Oh, this one? oh, okay. Oh, I see right in there. So this is for like the yellowing stuff? Yeah, we need uh, the soles are yellow. That's why you guys gotta get on that trip, Crip. Use my discount code, Trevor Man 10. <laughs> the Asian area right here. So um, cleanups done. Yeah, deep cleans, um, scuff, scratch removal. I take out the creases. Done. Yeah, this is gonna be a full restoration right here. So, what I'm gonna do with those. You gotta paint and or swap yeah. the sole? I'm gonna actually, uh, the sole is good, it's not crumbling. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take off the paint, I'm gonna put fresh paint on there. Then I'm also gonna. Um, what do you do with the elephant print though? How you? Yeah, yeah I'm just gonna clean it all up and everything. Yeah, I'm gonna clean it up, and then what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put in the shoe tree, stuff the shoe, so the shoe will get its form back mm, and uh, okay. you know have its. Uh, Definitely, you know, man. So if you guys in the area, make sure you guys uh, pull up and he can restorate your shoes for you. Definitely. I can't wait to see you the finishing. Yeah. What it looks like. I'll shoot you a picture. Yeah, for sure. You got a couple of your Jordans. What, is, what do you mainly sell here? You got. Jordan, you said everything's consignment. Yes, so I'm pretty much at the mercy of uh, what people bring me. But when I do buy, I, I typically buy uh, new releases. Right, right. So, of course, yeah. look at these, man. You can't go wrong with yeah. these. Yeah, uh, Fire Red 3s. It's just, I, I really like this. So Yeezys, Yeezys are pretty nice. I sold these. These are actually really nice. How you guys, how you do your pricing usually? Um, typically, what I do is I look at market and I try to stay you know, I try to stay behind last sale if I can, you know. So it's not like super tax and everything, right? Right, right. Yeah. There you guys right. go. Exactly. I, we appreciate that, man, because I know yeah. a lot of people say, you know, about some stores, it's like either it's really high or it's just too much. So appreciate right. you staying in the market, man. I haven't even got the warrant. Is this brand new? That is, that's uh, very near. Yeah, this is a good price, too. Yeah, very near. I think it was worn like maybe one time. I think that's what it, Jordan, what? It's a nice looking shoe. I haven't even worn mine. This is a good, it's a good price too, man. Yeah. For for what it for what these are. I think these are like five something. Yeah. Yeah. And I see you have some grills too, my goodness. Oh, yeah. You got, you got like so your red lot, red lobster, green lobster. Are you gonna get them? 
The new orange. ones? No orange ones? Um, probably, I don't know, if, it, if we can find them at the right price. price that's right, sure. They're pretty high. Controversy about that? Like the band and all that? No. There's no. something going on about it. Some, from what I was told, the black bands, a lot of people saying, if it's black, it means it's fake. No. It means that, you know, most of the skate shops are getting the black bands from what I'm hearing, and the silver ones is from friends and family. And you have, is this a shoe? Oh, never mind. We have nice. Uh, what is this? Like a little figurine yeah, model, Gundam. Gundam model. Yes. I thought this was a shoe for a second because it had that Nike SB there. <laughs> Definitely, man. I just uh, appreciate you bringing me out to the shop, or you know, inviting me to the shop, man. Thank you so much, bro. Hey, thank you for coming. Appreciate Absolutely, you. Man. Appreciate Since we're close to Cleveland, how you guys feel about that? Um, the, the their new mascot, the Eve or the the elf, the elf. You see elf? that? Yeah, the elf guy. Yeah, yeah. How do you, yeah. you feel about the elf, the new elf uh, look? Uh, I like mascot. Yeah. Uh, yeah, brownie. His name is that his name, brownie? brownie? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> hey, they won though. They beat the Steelers yesterday. Oh, yes. I wonder how many people lost that bet. I appreciate you looking out for me, man. Hey, my pleasure. Yeah, absolutely. Pleasure. So again, you got the yellow toe joints. Woo! Such a clean freaking shoe, man. I mean, don't you feel like you know Air? Obviously, Air Jordan ones is not what it used to be. You know, because. Remember in 2020, like Air Jordan ones were crazy, you know? Yeah, they were. They definitely been slowing down. De yeah, a little hey, bit, that's for sure. It's a good time to, uh, if you guys want to buy Air Jordan ones, this is a, is a good time now, because especially when they're really low. I want to hear no more, oh, you guys are taxed on ones. It's like, bro, like just, they're not going for that much. Exactly. Yeah. And this is a great, great colorway. Like, I think one of my favorite Air Jordans to release so far this year, and it's, you know, Good materials. We've been needing a good material Air Jordan One. Um, I mean, we've been getting some random colorways and random, you know, prototypes. So I'm glad Nike finally gave us something nice like this. So yeah. thank you, bro. Appreciate You're it. Very welcome, man. Appreciate All right. you. Thank you so much, brother. Appreciate your business. Yeah, absolutely. So make sure you guys check out Ransom Retros here in Canton, Ohio. He does restorations. Has a little bit of uh, inventory here as well and some heat. So. Mm -hmm. Appreciate you, bro. Thank you so much. Appreciate right, you. guys, so we're back at the hotel, man. So we just picked up the Yellow Toes Air Jordan 1s. Wasn't able to get a W nearly when I was in, you know, now that I'm traveling. It's really hard for me to, to cook when I'm traveling and stuff like that. That's why sometimes I hate traveling because when I do travel, it's always on the weekends and there's always releases and I can't do pickup vlogs and stuff like that. So, yeah, I got to do the best I can. So shout out to the homie that looked out for me. Yeah, definitely. This is one shoe that I really wanted to keep in my collection. I already let the one that I had already that was I got it previously from the Shock Drop from Sneakers. Uh, I already let it go and because I figured I was like, hey, I can probably get a new a pair anyways. But uh, turns out that it wasn't the case. But hey, it's all good, man. I was, I was it was good enough to get a, a really good price on these things. So fine. It seemed like a lot of people had trouble with the Flex app, you know, for. I swear, I freaking hate the Flex app. It is, I haven't won all year in 2020. It's been really awful, not just because I take L's, it's because it's like, it's such a terrible app. You can't get into it. I haven't seen people hit me like, yo, I couldn't confirm or whatever, or then I, I didn't, wasn't able to get into the app and I didn't confirm in time and then they took an L. Flex app, they need to do something with that app, man. That thing is straight ass. Sneakers app. Now, earlier I saw that there wasn't any men's, but it looks like the men's popped up. This will be this will be coming out tomorrow, 10 a.m. So good luck in these things. It's coming in all sizes, GS sizes, men, you know, kid sizes, and all that. So you should really have a big, big problem getting these things if you really, really want it. And you put a little bit of footwork in, you know. If you guys, let's just say you took all L's throughout the board, then maybe try to like, you know, do some un unclaimed pairs or something like that. Or and they're not really going for much so you know you could probably pick up a pair someone had got a got a w probably pay for a little bit just a little bit over retail it should be fine but overall man this is a great looking shoe i love it man i love the materials on these things i love the color blocking i think this is a great looking shoe to rock these things and put these things on feet and you guys already know i feel like the people that did end up passing on these things are going to regret it down the road man i think people are gonna be like yo I kind of wish I got them when the price was low or they tried on release date or something like that. So I think a lot of people, if you guys didn't try to get these things, you're going to end up regretting not getting them. So like I said, I think it's a great looking shoe, man. So good luck for everyone that got these things if you guys really want them. But anyway, guys, that's pretty much end of the video, video guys. Hope you guys enjoyed it. If you guys don't mind, please hit that thumbs up. Subscribe if it's your first time here. 
comment down below and please hit that bell for all the notifications when I do draw vids. And don't forget to follow me on my social media at German Chris and IG. Sometimes on Twitter and don't forget Snapchat. And I'm also on TikTok. Anyway, guys, appreciate y'all. Love y'all. I'm German Chris. Peace. Pew.